Boy Forever and you're watching another video by iPod King Carter. Don't forget to hit that like button and if you want to become a part of Team IKC, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below, boo. King Carter, King Carter, King Carter, iPod, King Carter, King Carter. Chase the Joe will step king, a baller named Carter Dave. I pod on the point guard, calling plays. I'm a rookie, but I'm going through another phase. You'll see when your coach screaming, yo, he got a change. I'm the best. Who's this Paul y'all speak about? We go head to head, back door, y'all better sneak him out. Out the arena, cause the game, he ain't showing up. When I give him 50, watch my name start blowing up. All the kids with the iPod jerseys on Gave Rose 35 cause I had mercy fall Got a killer instinct like a rebel grown in Pakistan Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here I'm actually taking on LeBron James in the Miami Heat for the first time of the season Now, being able to see the Heat in Miami Your first game as a rookie as I get that nice little flashy pass It is, man, I'm just gonna have to put it like this when I was in the locker room, I had my three beats on, and I'm nodding my head. And I'm like, man, I'm about to see the big three. <laughs> but, you know, I kept a clear head. So, you know, I'm just trying to come out here, try to get a win, because this team is ferocious. Check out LeBron James as he goes to the right. Did you see him get wild with us? You know, put a little, little front on after he dunked it. But, hey, man, our defense does step it up from time to time as Morrow gets that nice block. Now, even though we are supposed to be out on a break, you know they always make you stop. But I'm going to take the nice jump shot if Ray Allen don't want to step it up. Now, uh, on the NBA.com side of things, I've seen that LeBron James actually isn't leading the league in scoring, which he really never does. Of course, we already know that Kevin Durant, he's putting up probably about 33 points, maybe the 35 points per game. Yes, guys, he's putting up numbers. But LeBron James is a walking triple-double. This dude, I think, averages about 29 points, 8 rebounds, and like 7.4 assists. Like, it is unreal on how much LeBron James is averaging. Even though he does that in real life, it's just miraculous to see how much a game can actually show that. Now, that play, we messed that all up. Is Cole gets the nice dunk. Hey, man, I don't know what to say, man. Sometimes turnovers happen, you know. But me, on the other hand, as a rookie, you guys would think, ah, man, you're probably averaging like 17 some points. I'm actually trying to step it up as I get that nice little steal right there. Yeah, I still get the cookies from time to time. Um, I'm actually trying to figure out what I want to average in my rookie uh, career. I want to go for the MVP, which is, you know, what everybody wants to do. Everybody wants to come in, start their my player, get the MVP, go to the All-Star game, show out, and stuff like that. But I'm trying to figure out what I want my averages to be. Now, I know I could probably average about three to four steals per game. But I want to average at least like 12 assists and 20 plus points per game. Now, when it comes to rebounds, I'm always the shortest guy on the court. You know, I'm only 6'1". You know, it's not too many short point guards in the league. Nowadays, you know, you have those athletic point guards that's tall, such as, you know, Westbrook, Rose, stuff like that. So, you know, 6'1", uh, kind of short. But I do got some nice long arms. But check out LeBron as he goes in and beasts. There's no reason he should be doing this to us, man. Like, he's just disrespecting us on all levels. But, you know, sometimes I be trying to believe in my team. So, you know, I kick it out to Miller and he misses the three. It pissed me off when he missed it because he was so wide open. But look at LeBron going coast to coast. Oh, my God. Is that signature skill real, that one-man fast break? That LeBron coast to coast, is that real? Because he took that from the other end just to get the nice scoop layup. Now, I tried to do it up and under. It didn't work out to the best of my ability, but I did pass it off for the nice assist. Now, one thing, let me tell you all about D-Wade. Now, we all know that D-Wade is a quiet guy, and, you know, he really never does much. But, yo, when LeBron isn't in a game, he takes over the offense. Now, did y'all see that pass? LeBron James wasn't even in the spot, and he still gets the ball. I don't know how that happens. But, you know, the clock is winding down. I take the shot, and you know it was off. You guys know I ain't got no three-pointer. I don't even know why y'all believed it was going to go in. But, uh, yeah, D-Wade... I like seeing him play because, you know, he's tricky when he gets to the rack. He, he dribbles kind of slow, and then he gets, you know, the nice little reverse layups and all of that. But let me tell you how this Miami Heat team looks now. Chalmers is gone. 
Chalmers is no longer on the Miami Heat. Ramon Sessions is actually on the Heat. And um, I think, who else? Is, oh, excuse me. Let me get this cookies real quick. You know, I had to pass it off, man. I like getting assists. You know, sometimes they ain't always about the points. But, yeah, man, for whatever reason, Chalmers just isn't on the Heat anymore. I would have liked to see him. But, you know, Ramon Sessions, he cool. You know, he's a good baller and everything. But did y'all see LeBron James hit that three? Like, look at, did y'all see the points he put up? Like, this man put up 17, you know what, we're not even going to talk about it. LeBron might have 50 on this tonight. I'm going to just put it like that. Like, he might have 50 on this. But, yo, I'm looking like Michael Carter Williams out here. If y'all remember the first game of real life NBA season with the Sixers versus the Heat, remember when MC Dub was just taking the ball from LeBron and, and LeBron couldn't do nothing. The body just kept getting ripped, getting his passes taken out of midair. That's how I'm feeling right now. I'm getting all these cookies and it's real out here. But check out LeBron James settling for the jump shot when it was a clear lane to the hoop. He could have dunked on me and three of my teammates and, you know, we wouldn't have been able to do nothing about it. But, oh, man, Ray Ray, I was so happy he missed that shot. Like, y'all don't understand how I felt. I was like, no, 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 not Ray Ray, not the best three-point shooter of all time. But, you know, we going into the fourth quarter, man. So far, things are looking pretty good. Now, you know, the assist of the game got to go to me, man, with the no-look bounce pass. Come on, y'all. Your boy get dimes out here. You got you to gotta congratulate. <laughs> Now, I just wanted to press start real quick and see what LeBron was doing, man. Yo, he put yo the numbers he be putting up now, y'all might have to run that back. But the numbers that he was putting up is crazy. But I'm still getting these cookies. I'm not letting it go without Vane. Now, check out Miller getting to the rack with a nice little scoop. Left hand layup. Now, one thing that I did notice was that my flashy passing, even though I don't have the signature skill, is miraculous i love throwing flashy passes and i do pretty good and i probably do better throwing a flashy pass more than a regular pass which is crazy now lebron james you guys know 30 and 9 come on three point shots four for four like i gotta pull out park moves to get to the rack like lebron james can just shoot threes i gotta do park moves some ain't adding up <laughs> but you know i'm at the line i'm a little cold but i make the free throw all good. I just wanted to show you guys that I can nail my free throws and I can hold on to a lead. Even though we are going up against LeBron James, you can never be too sure what's about to happen. Now, I did kind of, you know, mimic this game of a little LeBron versus IKC because all you do is see clips of me and him going off. You know what I'm saying? That's the way I like to see it. So, you know, LeBron James is getting his points and I'm trying to get mine. I caught him with a nice pump fake. He ain't know what happened. So, you know, I just had to hit a little dagger between his eyes. You know how the game go. But one thing I will tell you guys about my videos is I get the nice little cut case. Um, I turned off the commentary in game. Now, the reason for this is because I didn't want to get too many content ID matches, you know. Now, this game right here is probably like the first game I recorded after that big debacle with content ID. So, you know, I turned off the in game audio for the commentary. Let me know if you guys want me to bring it back because I've been watching a few of my uh, other fellas in the 2K community and I see that they're still using it and, you know, they haven't been complaining too much about it. Plus, I found out that I'm a managed partner with Machinima now. So, I think that content IDs, I probably won't be able to see those that much. But did y'all check out the crossover and the hop step I just pulled off out there? If that wasn't a foul, I don't know what it was. But, you know, LeBron James, he seems like, you know, he's just chilling. You know, letting me do what I do. Now, as a rookie, when you get clear space like this to the rack, you got to take it. And I guess the monster is dunk. I don't know why, but... When it's late in the game and games are close, it seems like the computer does not want to give up any three-point shots. Look at how everybody is playing tight at the perimeter. They're like, yo, we're not going to help out on defense. We're going to guard our guys. We're not going to let him pass it out to the three-point shot when we go in for help defense. And I just took over. So, you know, if they're going to let me keep going to the rack, why not? If you can't stop me, why not keep doing it? Now, that was clearly a foul. The refs... I'm going to tell you right now, they act just like they do in real life. They are not going to give any rookie any call he wants. I don't care what you're doing, but that call right there could have been a charge if Devin Harris would have stayed in this position. Now, that's another thing. Devin Harris, like, what is he doing on the Heat? Like, what, what the heck is... Yo, I don't know what the Heat are doing, what they did with their point guard position, but it seems like they got, like, three 
three new point guards and they still got a hole. So, you know, maybe it's something that they're trying out over there. I don't know. Maybe, you know, since they got every position um, other than point guard filled, I think they're pretty good. So, you know, I don't know what Dwayne Wade was doing. He was playing a little bit of hot potato, but got caught with the spin cheese. You know how that thing go. But check out the pass to me and did I just dunk on LeBron James, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> But this game is winding down. This right here is the last play as I get the cookies from LeBron again. Feeling like MCW out here in these streets. I shoot, I'm, I thought I almost got a triple-double with still. You know, I was doing so well. But this game is over. We have 11 seconds left. I'm going to let LeBron come down and do what he needs to do. He passes it off. He doesn't want to take the last shot. Don't know why. But um, me and him actually did have a long talk in the arena after the game. And I'm going to let you guys see it here first. Hey man, glad I caught you. I was hoping to have a chance to talk with you for a few minutes before getting out of here. What's up, LeBron? So listen, I just wanted to let you know that you caught my eye. I've liked your attitude and I see the potential in your game. Thanks, man. It's nice to hear coming from you. But you got a long way to go. When I see a young guy like you with the chance to make a real impact in this league, I'd like to try to share some of the things I've learned early on that helped me to be successful. Yeah, I'm always willing to listen to one of the greats. What you got? All right, so there's three things I've always tried to stress to a player at this point in their career. First, try to give your mind a break every once in a while. I mean, if all you do is think about basketball, it can become too much. Take some time before the game, clear your head, listen to some music, read a book, do whatever. Just make sure you can get away enough to refocus mentally and get yourself in the right place. That's cool, I can dig that. What else you got? Okay, second, be smart with your decisions. Be careful who you associate yourself with. And don't forget that there's always people around who will try to take advantage of you. <laughs> For sure. I've experienced some of that already, man. You have no idea, man. And third, the most important, keep pushing yourself to the limit. If you ain't willing to put in the time, you better believe there's a hundred other players that are. Hard work will take you a long way, man. Don't let your talent go to waste. That's a lot to think about. I'm definitely gonna keep it in my mind, though. You do that. I'm sure we'll be meeting up again sometime soon. Looking forward to seeing what else you can do, both on and off the floor. Hey, thanks, man. I really appreciate you coming over and talking to me today. Oh, for sure, man. Good luck with the rest of the season. Man, you already know me and LeBron going to club live. All right. Okay. Oh, um, I got put into the starting lineup. Thank you so much, Monty. I love you. <laughs> wow. Hey, thanks, coach. Of course I've been playing very well. I just beat the Miami Heat, for goodness sake, man. Man, I really appreciate that, Coach. You will not be disappointed, I promise. All right, you guys. This is IKC signing out. I'm going to see y'all in the next video, man. Make sure y'all leave this video a like. Peace. Yes, sir, for sure. I'll see you soon. Year, this is Siri. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode, click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC, click subscribe. Oh, and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.